YouTube. What is going on, y'all? It is your boy, Young Texas, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you're all having a fantastic day today. Tomorrow is officially the day. December 14th, Season 1 Reloaded goes live in Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2 worldwide. Mid-season updates, commonly known as the Reloaded updates, have been commonplace in Call of Duty since Modern Warfare 2019, the very first Call of Duty to introduce seasons. Of course, with such a significant update going live, in both Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2, there is plenty of new and exciting content that players should expect. With plenty to cover before tomorrow's update, let's get straight into it. I recently made a video discussing exclusively the raids that are going to be coming to Modern Warfare 2 Special Ops with the Season 1 Reloaded update, so to spare you a repeated deep dive, I'm just going to cover the new information. Players looking to complete the Atom Grad raid will first need to unlock their raid assignment in one of three ways. The first being through the completion of a specific daily challenge in either multiplayer or special ops. The second being placing in the top 20 of any battle royale mode in Warzone 2. And the third using the final X-Fill helicopter in DMZ with $30,000 in cash. Again, the only way to unlock the Atom Grad raid is through one of these three methods. Also coming to multiplayer is Shipment, one of the most iconic maps in Call of Duty history. Similar to what we saw with Vanguard, Shipment will be receiving a holiday update on December 21st, later reverting to its normal design, but unlike what we saw with Vanguard, players are not going to be able to hop on top of the crates. And also, wait for it, the thing of nightmares, Krampus is nowhere to be found. Taking a look at DMZ, this little update will have Easter egg hunters on their toes ready to drop in. Building 21 is a brand new location in DMZ that is unlocked through finding keys around the map, but I have to tell you, only the strongest operators will survive in building 21. High tier contraband will be available for any operator brave enough to face this tall task, but I have to tell you, there is still some information that has been redacted, so not all is known for those operators that are going to go into building 21. So be on the lookout because you don't know exactly what you're going to be walking into. Mini Royale returns to Warzone as well as Call of Duty's take on Rocket League. In Warzone Cup, two teams of three will hop onto the back of their Pulse Ability equipped ATVs going onto El Yzma Field to knock a soccer ball into the back of a net. Yes, it's literally Rocket League in Call of Duty. Some more general updates will be made across both titles with some great content up for grabs. Firstly, two new operators in Kyle Gaz Garrick and Klaus Fisker will be available to drop into the fight for you through the purchase of an in-store bundle. However, those looking for a free way to unlock Gaz, if you go ahead and complete that Atom Grad raid, you are going to unlock the Gaz Operator as well as a skin that is completely different from the one you get from purchasing the in-store bundle. It should be noted that players that complete both the Atom Grad raid and purchase the Gaz bundle in the store will be awarded a third exclusive skin for Gaz. A new weapon will be available for players to add to their armory in the Chimera Assault Rifle. Drawing comparisons to Infinite Warfare's Honey Badger, players can unlock the Chimera Assault Rifle through the purchase of an in-store bundle or through the completion of a currently unspecified in-game challenge. To add some icing onto the cake, double XP and double weapon XP will be available across Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2 starting on December 15th at 10 a.m. Pacific and ending on December 19th at 10 a.m. Pacific. Those on PlayStation get 24 hours extra of double XP with their bonus period starting on December 14th at 10 a.m. Pacific. With much on the horizon for Call of Duty, and I don't just mean content, be sure to keep tabs on the channel so you never miss a thing. But yeah, guys, that is effectively going to wrap up today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to drop a like and comment on it down below. Subscribe to the channel and hit that bell to turn on those notifications so you never miss any of my daily uploads. For even more from me, be sure to check out the links in the description below to connect with me on all of my social media so you never miss any of my content. Also, for the latest and greatest Call of Duty news, 
Intel, and so much more. Be sure to use the links in the description below to connect with IPC on all of our social medias as well as our website. But other than that, hope you all have a great rest of your day, and that's been it. Peace. Peace.